guys and welcome to Medieval Mayhem. On this channel you'll find lots of videos across the whole medieval period. We do lots of reviews into other people's gear, we do crafting videos into costuming, we do DIY videos into uh, furniture and this kind of thing. We do videos about medieval encampment and cooking and we do analysis videos into the events that took place, who were the key people and why did things turn out the way that they did. If medieval is your thing, this is the channel for you and you might want to consider subscribing Yes, I know the beard has gone. Long live the beard. Alrighty guys, welcome to Knot of the Week. So we're going to do a whole bunch of different knots and this is really about uh, developing some skills for medieval style campments and that kind of thing. So whether you're into live action role play, medieval reenactment or the SCA or lots of other groups, perhaps you'd just like to develop your knot tying skills. Maybe you're just in school or, or in the scouting movement, that kind of thing. This is a great place to learn some of that stuff. We're going to be doing at least one knot a week, sometimes more. Um, and they're going to be very simple step-by-step -step instructions. Let's take a look. Today's knot is the reef knot. Alrighty guys, the bowline knot. A really, really simple knot to tie. Very, very useful. Uh, and one of those knots that you're going to learn a lot in the military, you'll also learn it in scouting, you'll also learn it um, in all sorts of different aspects of life. Uh, fantastic not to know. As I said in, in previous videos like this, knowing how to tie proper knots is super, super important, I think, and it just shows that you kind of put a bit of pride into what you're doing. Okay, the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna put a loop in the knot. The tail of the knot, the end, goes on top like so. We're going to pass the tail through, around, just keeping it nice and tidy, and then through the hole again. And you'll find you now have a very nice, neat and tidy knot. Very simple to tie, very simple to undo. I'm using a natural fiber rope like most of you will be doing. You'll find it doesn't necessarily work quite as well with uh, some of the synthetic ropes, but this definitely works very well like this. Make sure you leave a, a good end of the tag here. That's at least three inches, roughly seven and a half centimeters long. Um, perhaps slightly longer, but it, it's nice not to know really good to use and I think it makes your whole kind of encampment situation look a lot more tidy and professional and I guess you know well thought out. Right here guys um, please like subscribe and share I'll catch you in my next video.